Welcome to Mechanical Tutorials. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. Hi, today I am going to explain about lofted surface and I am going to show you lofted surface with uh, guide curves and without guide curves. So this is the component I am going to show you. So other one is this component. So let's start now. See here in lofted surface, unlike uh, solid modeling, we can use open loop. So I have created three sketches. and I am selecting all the three so this is useful for creating veins airplane body parts or wings of propeller so next I am going to show you with a closed loop here I have created three sketches. One is a, one is slot, other is circle, and one is rectangle. So here we have to go to lofted surface. Then we have to select the profile so when we select this profile it automatically generates the surface so this is without guide curves so for loft surface we need minimum two cross sections and we can do any n number of cross sections for loft surface so here I am going to show you lofted surface with guide curves so I have created simple circular slot and one circle on other plane and I have created a guide curve with 3D sketch. So here from here we can take 3D sketch and we can select these points. And this is one more guide curve. Now here I am going to show you how to use guide curves with two simple cross sections or profiles. See here I need to select two profiles. Then I have to go to guide curves and select this. Uh, so you can see it is meeting uh, if I delete this see there is a variation I think we can see in front view there is a variation so this helps us to meet the desired shape so here it's not meeting so I can select this curve so it is meeting so that's how we can develop a surface of desired shape using guide curves so other options I am going to teach in tips and tricks and uh, with examples in product design
so that's how we can create lofted surface thank you